anytime you're talking, I'm thinking, if I was talking right now, I'd be fine. And then it's my turn, and then I get really giggly. <laughs> <laughs> what a busy week last week. Okay, any teacher that you talk to says that this is the time of year that kids, they just get a little antsy. They're or ready TV for hosts. summer. Me yeah. too. Mm -hmm. We're all ready for summer. We want a little break. And homework? What homework? Mm. But imagine if your child struggled with motivation all year long. Oh, that's so frustrating. When we introduced you to Killian Wilson back in 2013, you guys, he had just finished the Learning RX program. So he went through the training. Because frankly, he couldn't focus. He was getting in trouble at school and he was diagnosed with ADHD. But now this college student says that program helped him prove everyone wrong. Twin Cities Live reporter Kelly Hansen has his story. When Killian Wilson was six years old, he was diagnosed with ADHD. And that meant school, no matter the subject, wasn't easy. I would just always forget to turn in homework and or forget to do it or not know or learn something and not know what we did, so I'd do it wrong on the homework. He's not focused and he's out of his seat and you know, and teachers don't know what to do with it, so they just you know, provide a referral and give him a detention. But none of that's working. Five years have gone by since we first met Killian. He graduate in how many months? Four, three, <laughs> yep. Very soon. Yep. And he's about to graduate college. He was in his freshman year of high school, and I wasn't sure he was going to make it through that. Looking back, Killian's mom, Ann, remembers thinking college would never happen. Killian thought the same. I was struggling with uh, being able to focus and uh, staying on task and just being interested, I think, um, was one of the main problems. But the Learning RX program, where brain games helped him regain focus, changed everything. Wonderful people worked with him on a daily basis, um, and we did the 24 week program, and it was amazing to see the transformation in him from the beginning to the end. Do you think Learning RX prepared you for the last four years that you've had here? Yeah, yeah, I think Learning RX has been a, a great program, and uh, it really did help me get to the point where I needed to be to completely excel in school. And, be the best student and person I could be. He didn't think he'd make it through high school. Yeah. And now he's made it almost through college. Right. We're in the home stretch. Exactly. What's it yeah. feel like to be the mother of a college graduate? Oh, very exciting, especially to see him. He found his passion, which is architecture. Um, it pulls together all his skills and abilities and his ability to use his hands and use his brain and the creative side. Um, uh, plus with all the other academics that he has. It's just, it's so exciting. You're going to be an architect. You're getting a degree from the University of Minnesota. Yep. This is a big deal. Yeah. You realize this. Yeah, it's really exciting to just know that everyone thinks it's really cool. And even for myself, it's been it's nice to see how far I've progressed. From a student that was struggling to the person I am now, it's, it's really cool. <laughs> So I'm Rich Frieder is here. Rich is the executive director for Learning RX, and I just love seeing that progress. And that's the big picture. But mm -hmm. what I think is really cool right now is you're going to show us the little tiny picture, which is what are these little things that you're doing in these sessions to help retrain the brain. So, yeah. okay, I have a little, um, you know, piece of paper here with a bunch of arrows and colors. It's a little brain colors. game of sorts. Now, exactly. This is something that somebody would encounter at Learning RX, right? Right. So okay. we do a lot of different activities. We call them games for kids. They're actually really intense exercises yeah. that are strengthening your skills. So you want to try some? So I'm going to try some. I'm looking at the same paper that you were looking at at home. Yep. And Rich, tell me what you need me to do. I'm going to start okay. in the very top So row. what I want you to do is for the top two rows here, okay. I want you on every other Starting beat here. to this metronome okay. to tell me, just tell me the direction of the arrows. Okay. And every we'll, other beat. Every other beat. Left, up, right, left, left, up, left, right, right, left, down, down, right, left, up, left. Okay, so Good. now what we might do in the center is while you're doing that, I might be distracting you on purpose. Oh, I don't like Because we're training your attention skills, we're training your ability to tune distractions out. So, yeah. so like, what are you going to have for dinner? Exactly. Uh, yeah. And maybe oh, this gosh. time, you and I, while he's doing the next one, we should just distract him. Oh, Rich, Isn't we have the next a lot one already going to be we trickier, do. though, Rich? Okay, so yeah, what's the we're going to step it up a bit. So this time, that was too easy for you. This mm -hmm. time, what I want you to do is the same thing, but flip the arrows as if they were turned a quarter turn clockwise. And I'll start in the top row again. Which is facing left, and so then you're going to start with up. Okay, here we go. All right. Up, 
and we right. can try to distract him. Down. Boy, it's been, hasn't the up. weather been so nice, yeah, Rich? Up. It's awesome, it's just right? Been Finally outside. I mean, up. how bad did you feel down. when that blizzard hit? Down. Oh, that was awful. Steve just kept complaining left. about it, too. I hated he wouldn't stop. I hated when you showed left. the video, I know. When you showed the video of it. Uh, I was like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we maybe found one of his weaknesses that's okay. tuning out distractions, right? Yes, I have to go into headphones when I work. Right. Yes. That is a problem that I have. Now, what's another one that you would do? Okay, then the next one would be go down to these words, and instead of saying the word, I want you on every other beat for two rows, tell me the color of the ink. Okay. Oh, color of the ink. So it says green, but the ink is blue. Yellow, black, blue, green, oh. yellow, Wait, what? <laughs> green, black, blue, green, black, green, <laughs> red, and black. Wow. Okay. So you did a good job. So over did time, go, does this happen? That oh, I mean, this is where you do this kind of like assessment, yeah, wow, figure tricky. out where people are at, and then you can make some significant improvements. Oh yeah, it's really cool seeing when when kids or adults start how hard things can be at the start. And by the end of the program, it's like, that was easy. In fact, I was just meeting with a, actually a CEO of a pretty large company that's doing training. He's in his mid forties. And when he started, he just struggled to do every other beat, just the normal direction. Yeah. Yeah. And now he said he's doing things like if it's blue or green, he turns it a quarter turn clockwise, yellow or red, a quarter turn counterclockwise with a faster speed, oh, getting wow. distracted. And what that's doing is training your brain, retraining your brain so that those results last. Rich, yes. this is incredible that stuff. That was really cool, Rich, yeah. thanks. Thank you so Absolutely. much. Okay, so Learning RX is offering TCL viewers a deal. You can call and mention Twin Cities Live to get an initial assessment for $75. It's regularly priced at $199, and we posted more information about the program on our website. That's TwinCitiesLive.com. A big thanks to Learning RX for sponsoring the show. Okay, if yeah. you 